Hi guys, just a quick little video today. Today's December 31st and uh, it's the end of the year and I don't know about you but I'm so done ready to shovel off this uh, 2020 into the archives and seal it forever and you know, let's not talk about it anymore. But I'm super excited about what 21, you know, has the potential to bring to us. Obviously there's still a lot of uncertainty but there's also a lot of great things that might happen. So today, just a quick a few points I want to talk about. And uh, those points are one, we will be actually rolling out a lot more videos coming in the new year. Obviously, the, uh, the Pacifica ripples is something that we strongly believe in and we will keep doing those. But actually, we'll be adding a lot of new helpful topics. Uh, if you know more real estate related uh, topics, such as what are the markets doing, uh, legal aspects, transactional aspects, uh, but also uh, we will be talking about the peninsula here, the lifestyle, you know, when we buy real estate here, do we only buy brick and mortar or, you know, the wood frame um, or do we buy something else? And then so lifestyle is, is, is it's a very important thing. So and uh, one of the, uh, the videos that will be the first one rolling out into January very soon, actually. That's because in many of us in our mailboxes, we'll be receiving the brand spanking new BC assessment. And so we'll be talking about what does a BC assessment really mean? Is it, is, is it a translation of value or is it something else, you know, that really we cannot quite relate to value. So uh, stay tuned for that. Super excited um, about talking about that one because it seems almost every year like, like you know, Groundhog Day the BC assessments come out and we talk again about what this what this um, represents to our clients. So it's really neat that we actually will be able to um, share that with you online uh, through these videos. So excited about that. The other aspect of this video is obviously to say thank you so much for, for uh, following us and also thank you to the entire community. You've been so incredible in your resilience in 2020 throughout this pandemic, you've been actually really inspiring us to what uh, you've accomplished as a community, sticking together some incredible people that we got to meet to kind of realize how, how creative and strong and, and you know, uh, with an approach that, you know, we just won't quit no matter how tough things uh, might get. And uh, so that is something that we, you know, really take to our hearts and, and inspires us to, to do uh, the same thing and to return in kind. So uh, really excited about a lot of stuff that will be coming into this new year. In the meantime, I wish all of you a happy new year and just an amazing 2021. Until very soon.